everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'm at Lincolnshire Showground for the BRC National Championships. We are back again. We weren't here last year, but we qualified the year before. That's where we came third as a team. But we're back this year, we've just arrived. We've been to sign in, we've got a gorgeous plaque for our door, and now we're heading to our stable. He's so confident in himself. Like, he's pulling me, but he loves it. He just loves it, don't you? This is the stable point now. This is the stable. He's got an end stable this time, which means he'll be able to look out on the view. Happy boy. You can't eat the grass this time because it's covered by straw. He's still managing it though. Silly Billy. No way, you can help yourself with the straw to put more bedding down for him. Look, oh my god, you can't see it. There it is. We get to help ourselves to all of that straw. And the water is literally just there. So, super duper easy. Do you think you'll need all of that? Just trying to make sure he stays clean <laughs> after you've bashed him. Big bed means less poo stains. That is show, isn't it? He normally eats the straw though, so. He normally eats this, don't you? Look at him. I can guarantee as soon as I put it down, he'll be eating it. Like, I meant when I open it. I need some scissors. Yeah, a key. Where are your keys? There. Good idea. Is it working? Kind of. Meanwhile, Bueno's finding little patches of grass. When I was actually really, really thirsty, as I gave him some water, he was writing. He was literally pushing me to get to the water. Weren't you? Yes, you were. Silly me, thought that the bed was just gonna open up and I'll be able to kick it where I want it. But no, of course. It opens up into blocks. So now I'm individually spreading it around. Great. Well, can I just say that some little pony is going to be having an amazing sleep tonight. I'm just praying that he does not get any poo stains. He will though. I just I just know it. See so yeah, I told you before, didn't I? As soon as I put the bed down, he will start eating the straw. But it's okay because I'm going to take him back to the trailer now. See where my mum's up to with getting the tent out and everything. And then maybe tack up and ride. As it's like sun setting or going to sunset soon. And it'll be nice riding when that's happening. And we'll go around to where the arenas are and everything. Sorry, I've just taken my crock off <laughs> to dust off my feet. My socks were all straw. I mean, I worked hard to get that bed. Look at it, so big and puffy. Lovely. So, I'm on Buena now, giving him a little exercise, and then after I've given him a walk around the showground, I'm going to go and find somewhere where I can have a trot or the canter, maybe up there. If you watch my BRC National video from two years ago now, we went there after prize giving and we all had a canter, like a fast gallop and raced each other. So I'm going to go in that same place. Um, yeah, just having a walk around now and I love this place so much. I'm not sure, we'll have to have a look. Yeah, 
You need to course walk tonight, don't you? So, he knows it's dinner time, you can hear him whinnying his head off. <laughs> oh, you me. Just... Sorry, there you go. There you go. Good boy. He's all done for the night now. And we are off to walk four courses right now. And I've got to remember them all. So let's go. Can I just say before you go, look at that beautiful sunset. No. Isn't that just gorgeous? Yeah. That bed is fit for a king. So guys, I've got four courses to walk tonight. Both my 70s and both my 80s. I'm starting with my first 70. So this is the first class that I'll be doing tomorrow. Bang on 10 o'clock. So at 10 o'clock, I'll be literally trotting and cantering and jumping in this ring. Let's go and let's hope I remember everything. Rather large, but all the jumps are close together. Snacking on the go. Oh, quite like this arena. I don't know what Bueno is going to think of it though. Oh my god, it's crazy. There's so much going on. Look at the jumps. Wow, that's madness. I did actually want to speak just that name, but I had to take the sweet out of my mouth. I feel like this is a male of the year. Mm. Well, the big one, you know, with all the branded banners along the sides there. Anyways, let's get to walking this one. And then we've got three more to do that. Oh, he will love that. He's really going to like this one, eh? I don't really think it's the worst one. Oh, the sunset again. Gorgeous. Where's yeah. number one? So guys, I'm on to the third arena now and it's gone dark. I'm just walking up to number 10 and then 11, 12, 
and then I've got to walk that arena which is next to this one and it's already gone dark and we've still got to make dinner <laughs> so yeah we're organized as usual aren't we Ava we are we just need to make sure all these courses are walked and then I can go over them in the morning and rewalk them if I need to 10 so we finally finished the fourth course walk I, I tell you I've struggled to see the fences and I've been like what what where where but now we've finished and we're going to go back to the trailer to our little camp set up and make dinner. I think we're having pasta. We are. With a bit of halloumi, so I can't wait for that. We are just cooking our tea. It's about half past nine at night and um, we're in the trailer. It's very cosy, tents outside. And uh, this is our setup. So we've got our little chairs. You can't really see. There's our food. And then wait. Hold till on, if you do that again, then I'll. Oh, there we go. Um, so here's all in our chairs. Here's our little fridge. It's not working, is and it? Our working food. Out there. Out there. And then if you turn it round, you've got like. And then hold on, I'm going to do a big whiz round. There we go. There we go. There's our little eating area. So the kettle's on to make pasta and um, we've had, we've fried some halloumi so we're going to mix that in oh, with the good old pasta. Halloumi. So it's quite toasty and warm in here isn't it? Yeah. Good morning everyone, we've just got up, I've been on Fred Bueno and then I realised Pooh's staying free and then his rug started slipping behind his back as we were walking here. And he did the sloppiest poo ever and it's gone all over his legs and his rug so i'm just taking him to the water back at his stable to give him a wash with my bucket go on dirty boy so i've just come down to the courses to have a little look over them again in the light as it was pitch black last night when we were walking on just what? gone through each and every one of them in my head. It's a lot to remember, four yeah. courses, one after the other. Literally straight in, so warm up in, quick warm up in, quick warm up in, quick warm up in. How are you feeling? Excited, really excited. We need to go and tack up now and get warmed up because otherwise we're going to be in a rush if we don't go now. Okay, let's go. So we've got about 45 minutes until you are on. Yep. So I want at least 20 minute warm up, maybe a bit longer. So we're in a bit of a rush now. I didn't get to film while it's tacking up because we had to be so quick. I've now got less than 25 minutes before I need to be in the ring and I want to have a nice warm up. So you're happy with the course that you think you know everything, yeah? Yeah, that's how you've done How you feeling though? You're a little bit nervous, are you no, okay? I'm really excited. You don't really get nervous, do you? No, I think I've just done it too many times to get really nervous. You're in that ring now. <laughs>
And that was 12 volts for Alexandra and Rashmi River Dance. First competitor on the track now, this is that's after the break that is. Uh, this is Isabel Newton Webster. She's riding Molly for the Area 19 team. The Area 19 team currently have one competitor on the track. Jumping now is number 589, Ava Richards and Mr. Bueno. second over that time and as does incur one time penalty so it is the one time on the card of Kelly Starr and Heidi Goodley Gray. Seven have jumped turning into the pack tray that has the top of the podium and how long can we hold on to that with my nose to come? 46 one eight the time as they're chasing down. Now for Emily Chapman and the top the boat is lining up it's not for small print number six seven And that was a clear round for Ava. It's going quite quick now, like six is going back, but it's got. So you've not told us how that first round went. Oh, right, yes, of course. A clear, but it was a tricky clear, like hard work. I did. I thought we knocked the pole when we first went into the double. And I was listening at the end thinking, is it clear? Is it clear? And then when I heard the clear, I was like, oh, thank God. So we're just going over to your second round of your 70 now, which is in a different arena. Yeah. So tell me about that. Riding at the moment is number six. If I go clear in the first Emily eight Hemming. fences, I'm allowed to go a bit quicker, like into the jump off because it's two phased, meaning first couple of fences to number six is cl like clear round really and then the last fences are timed like a jump off i think actually we'll double check that because i think it might be up to um it's number seven is it number seven oh, eight, yeah. yeah seven or eight but there's not really any turns that i can do here's another person in the ring who's with my riding club. And the final rider for the South Number Two, they have uh, Just going into the warm-up for the 70 second round. I'm not going to do a lot as it's quite warm, but I'm just going to jump two fences maybe. Ox running upright, and then I'll be ready to head off. Thank you. 
Well, well done, Harry. That was a clear round in the second round here in the main ring. That gives you a two-round individual total of eight. Well, that's only our second rider in this Junior 70 Championship to record clear across the board. Richards and Mr. Bueno go in to second place at the moment. Well done, Ava. I heard you having to check him in and say, whoa, 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 no, no, no. <laughs> well done. How do you feel, Ava? I feel really happy that we've gone. Clearing both. I think you said you're the first one that's gone triple fair. Yeah. Oh, well done. So I'm at the HT arenas now on the warm up and the ring. Um, it's been a bit of a rush today, obviously going back and forth. He's really tired, but we just need to keep focused and ride around the courses, doing the best that we can do. Um, where of course East Yorkshire are in exactly the same position. They've got three players in the well, I think Yorkshire are on four, so both teams are on, on four. Leave it 
there, he's, he's feeling very feisty and I think he's had enough now. But we've still got two more rounds to do. <laughs> yeah. That was a clear round for Vicky and Lucy McGrath. Now that means that the three valleys could actually finish the first round on zero. So well done, Lucy. Next to go, number 589, this is uh, in fact on the track already, this 589 to Ava Richards, she's riding Mr. Bueno for Macclesfield, and I think it's the smallest pony of the day so far in this ring, just about. That was a clear round for Ava Richards and Mr. Bueno. Well done. Next is 832. 832. This is Kira Shafi with the uh, quotender, the riding for the Go. Station 12 o'clock. I'm so happy with him today. He was really good. He's been such a good boy. Very, what's the word? Patient, but also strong. I might go and walk the course again. Good idea. Walk the course, yeah. Wait inside. You don't have to wait for your time. Uh, I'm going to hope for the best and hope my legs don't burn because I haven't put any sun cream on my legs. Come on, boy, no, you've got this. Oh, that's, oh, that's when I scratched. Shut up. Come on, little boy. Come on. Come on, little boy. Come on, little boy. Come on, little boy.
He is tired. Good boy, Gwen. Oh, Buenos, is it? There's no way he could have got round that corner. No. So tired. Well done, Bueno. He is. Good boy. Good boy, Bueno. Oh. <laughs> so, look at his face. He's getting excited already. He's just happy. He's just proud. Proud pony, I don't And this is the other rider here from Macclesfield. We've got third place. So we have a second and a third. <laughs> Smiley. Girls, well done, girls. <laughs> Don't kick one up. And then we're just missing our third place. Okay, can you just look at that? Empty. Oh, you're a big show off. Okay, so uh, it's lap of honor time. Here we go. Yay, uh, on tight, girls. <laughs> Wait for the winner to go in. Well, well, you go. <laughs> and, uh, Are you ready? Well done, girls. Are you ready? Woo! 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 I know. Well, I noticed that <laughs> you enjoyed that. <laughs> I'm going to take some photos now.
Okay. Thank you very much, girls. Super proud of you. You've done amazing. Thank well you. done. Sarah. Yay! Well done, girls. Well done. Oh, look how nice that is. So nice. Yeah, you should put them on. You should put them on. I'm just going to put it over the top. Yeah. <laughs> that... I've only got two of the same of anything. Go, I need the literary size ever. Oh, fantastic. Should we have a picture? Yeah. yeah. We'll have to go to in there on the, on the Yeah, floor. let's go back in there. <laughs> let's go back in there. <laughs> That's great. Just pull it down a bit at the back. Picture. <laughs> Girls, excellent, excellent. <laughs> Just tried this jumper on and it's super nice. And the gold matches Bueno and is done colouring. You fancy spending a bit of money? I'll have to. <laughs> Again. It is super nice though, like it's like a main challenge, you know. No, it is nice. Great. Don't have to persuade me. Great. Mm -hmm. The boots I was looking at for Bueno. I've got actual bamboo in there. I like the fluffy ones, but they'll just get really dirty. Don't, don't really think they do a size to fit them. What these just for horse sizes? Oh no, well, they're too small. small, medium, large, but I've never really found a small yet. Thanks very much. I prefer this girth instead of the squishy one. We've ridden today, we've been shopping. I've collected my prizes from NAF that I won as prize money, and then you get to spend it because they sponsor the show. Mm -hmm. And we've basically finished now, done everything, and time to head home now. I am exhausted. I don't know about you. I'm not really, but well, it definitely is. What time did the alarm go off this morning? Half six? Half six. Half six. Yeah. So we still have a three hour drive <laughs> before we're home. It's been a good This is not ready. Show. Exactly, we've had beautiful weather. Which oh, I'm very good at. Please, please, please. Instead of a drink, I'll get one. You'll have to run back yourself. It's over there. Oh, really? Yeah, it's on the way. Mm. Okay, you have persuaded me, Ava. Have an ice cream. <laughs> What's about me? Do I deserve anything? Yes, you do. You deserve an ice cream. <laughs> I might. Get yourself um, one. But we'll end up getting there and there'll be like five pounds for like the singular. Yeah. One. I'll settle with my. With just the ice cream on it. I'll settle with a coffee when I get back to the trailer. How's that? I don't you... know how you can drink coffee. It's hot there. <laughs> I know. But I want coffee. to sit down, put my feet up for five minutes, have a coffee before we leave. And a three hour journey, Ava. Yeah. yeah. But Talking back to the 80 round, guys. The second, so first round was clear. Then he was just so exhausted in the second round that he just could no way have got round that course of 14 fences. No, I don't think so. Because he was really struggling halfway through. He was wasn't struggling he? getting over yeah. him. He was kind of trying to really kick him on. And then he was stopping and kind of jumping over them. I mean, you'll see in the video when you watch it. I've not watched any of the videos yet, but I will be doing yeah. it on the way home from the yard. And I think um, also, you know, it's been really hot today, hasn't it? And he literally did Non-stop, four... just go, go, go. Yeah, and he did four competitions back to back, didn't he? So it was a big ask of him. But he was a really good boy, wasn't he? A really yeah. good boy. So we've just got back to camp and I forgot that we have all of this to clean away and tidy. I've got the tent to put down <laughs> and I've got all inside the trailer to sort out. So guys, our weekend here at the BRC National Championships, we've had such a great time and we've also done very well as a team, me and Bueno have. Um, yeah, it's just, it's gone so quick, but it's also been so fun.
fun, we've had a great time and we'll definitely be training and qualifying next year. Won't we, mister? Yes, he's been such a good boy. I couldn't have asked for anything more, could I? Yeah, you've been such a good boy. And now we're going to go back to the stables and he's going to go out tonight and see his friends, have some grass and maybe, and hopefully asleep because he's super tired, aren't you? Anyway, thanks so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Just tried to keep it like short and sweet, but we've had a really fun weekend and I'll see you on my next video. Bye guys. Come on then, let's go load you and get your boots on.